Hi, welcome back. Let's just get straight into it. Here's everything I'm going to be using for my first set of duck nails. First is my chrome powder from Born Pretty. Next is my new favorite nude poly gel from Macart. My slip solution. My favorite top coat from Sabi Land as well. For the pinks, I'm going to use my Madame Glam gel polish and my SXC Cosmetics one. This set is freestyled, but I want to do a lot of bling. So I got a few different rhinestones. I got a pink one, a silver one, and these giant ones. I just unboxed them on my first ever live stream i'll have a link for you in the cards in case you missed it but yeah let's get these tips stuck on but yeah i can't believe i'm doing duck nails i've just been watching everyone do it i've been seeing so much inspo pics on instagram and i was just like oh would i be able to pull it off but then i thought to myself like there's nothing that i can't do like there's nothing i don't put my mind to that i can't do you know and i always try to remember like the main reason why i started the channel was like to test myself and to like challenge myself and also to prove to myself that like, i can do anything i put my mind to because i literally got my box of potty gel got a ring light put the camera on and i started filming my first ever video and i uploaded it straight to youtube like it was so like you know and i love that about myself so yeah i'm so happy with how they came out like this set was definitely freestyled i did have an inspo pick i'm not gonna lie the design was definitely a bit of copy and paste but you know i'm so glad i was able to pull it off this video is pretty straightforward, so I'm just going to let you guys listen to music, enjoy the video, and yeah, don't forget to leave a like and hit the subscribe button so you don't miss my future sets, because I'm absolutely in love with this poly gel. I can't wait to do so many more different things with it. Like, it was literally such a dream to work with. I even did the one bead method. Like, initially, I thought I would just do like a two bead, maybe three, because I wasn't too sure, like, how the poly gel would be. But guys, it was so buttery, silky, and like, not too firm, but not too, oh, definitely, definitely not runny oh uh, it's just perfect consistency as soon as i like shape the nail with the poly gel i can just leave it there and move on to the next one and just like do at least two three nails before going into the lamp and it doesn't flood my cuticles all oh, my days that's the biggest thing it doesn't flood my cuticles ah uh, do you know that's actually what makes my nails look so almost professional it makes them look so much more high quality because it wasn't flooding the cuticles the cuticles were like so clean and neat and it looks so professional and it was easy to file look mccart needs to just sponsor me at this point because <laughs> i can't get enough of this poly gel genuinely i bought this poly gel it wasn't sent to me it wasn't gifted i genuinely i bought this because i was genuinely desperate for a solid high quality nude poly gel that matches my nail bed and like really complements my skin you know it's like the perfect shade and guys this is literally it like i'm so happy that like my first purchase was like perfect you know i didn't need to be like oh it was rubbish i had to throw it away no thank god thank you jesus it's perfect <laughs> <laughs> do you know what this actually makes me want to get more products from my cart like i want to test out more things because this is such high quality you guys can see it for yourself it's not like i'm just talking to talk you know like you can see how smooth it goes on how easy it is to like move around the nail yeah i'm so pleased with this like so pleased with it even when i showed my friend i literally showed her the shorts video i did like flexing the nails and she was like oh my days whatever that base color you use is perfect like it looks so good it matches your skin perfect i was like oh my god like she didn't even know that i just bought this brand new mccart thing and that's exactly what i was looking for like the perfect nude poly gel Ugh, i can rant all day like i can go on and on and on but i won't but yeah how's everyone's summer going oh my days i completely forgot we're in summer like we're smacked down in the middle of summer how's everyone's summer going i hope you're all doing well my summer's meh. my summer's been it's been what it is like <laughs> but i will say this though i have been seeing on tiktok every time i scroll for my for you page every, everyone's just saying like oh how boring the summer is no one's coming out no one's planning anything everyone's indoors like everyone's just rotting in bed <laughs> <laughs> and i'm like low-key silent repost silently i can relate but like i try to force myself like to go out like i be you know making trips all the way to my mom's house like making myself come out pretty much like side notes side notes I don't know what's been going on but like i definitely feel like my diet is really changing because all i've really been craving don't get scared i know i said craving i'm not pregnant <laughs> but like really been craving watermelon i'm not joking the weekend before i think or two weekends ago i literally had only watermelon the whole weekend like friday saturday sunday like I had two full watermelons it was all i was craving even today i went out again today and i bought myself a big massive watermelon huge like i've been joking around oh yeah i'm going vegan i'm going vegan nah. i did actually go vegan when i was 18 for like the whole summer and it, it worked out really well because like my acne got sorted out like I, I didn't have breakouts like my skin got so good like you know i lost a little bit of weight like you know like 
I'm a vegan. But now, I really feel like I might have to because that's all I'm craving. Literally, if I eat anything else, I'm just like, ugh. I just lied to you. Do you know why? <laughs> Do you know why I just told a lie? So I went to KFC today and I bought myself two hot wings. <laughs> And then I also went to McDonald's and I bought myself a double cheeseburger. I haven't had it in years. Believe me though, I don't. it's not a regular thing. I haven't had McDonald's like, burgers in years. So yeah, that's only because like, I don't know, I was just craving a little bit. Like, I don't know, you know? So I just had it and I definitely scratched an itch. But like on a regular, I can't do it. Like even my meal prep that I cooked and like froze, it's like a bean curry, white kidney bean curry with mixed veg and brown rice. Ooh, do you know what else I got today as well? I got myself some red lesser cheese and I poured that all over the curry. It was just so delightful. Love a Lee. Ooh, that's just like a little dietary update. I don't know what's been going on. I feel like I'm having so many like changes and like my body, like, you know, I definitely do need to revisit my diet. I can't be eating the way I've been eating. Like I need to cut out a lot of sugar and like carbs. Obviously, naturally, like, obviously you crave it a little bit, but the feeling afterwards, I'm like, oh no, I can't do it. I can't do it. I don't know what was going on. But yeah, I'll keep you guys updated on my like diet and my lifestyle and stuff. Like I might be going vegetarian so i feel like vegan was such a huge jump that like i would always like crash out and like fall back into like regular food but i think if i take it a step at a time and like go vegetarian first that will make it easier you know there's certain things i'm not ready to let go of yet i have to wean myself off it i could go cold turkey i'm not gonna lie to you i genuinely could because for breakfast all i have is like my my green smoothie and then snacking i've been craving like grapes carrots all that stuff all that fresh stuff so i feel like i could do this like give me some support guys like yeah i can definitely do this if you're making any like changes to yourself like to your life let me know let's talk about it but yeah i'll let you guys watch oh my gosh i said i was gonna <laughs> i said i was gonna stop talking and like let you guys enjoy the video but i've been ranting about chicken and watermelon anyways for real for real this time i'm gonna let you guys watch and enjoy and i'll definitely speak to you guys soon mm. Chayo, 
for the result, oh I'm too to discuss, oh Cause I take win by default And without any doubt, oh I'm a me happy adult, oh I no go feed the girl I no go feed the girl, it's out, oh I'm a mind that should be dark, oh I put my life into my job And I know I'm in trouble She manipulate my love, oh And I know that I can't pose Like the Baba Frayo Ha-ha-yo Don't cry yo Ani Bigo Asha 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 yo I did put a cut one then kill Soboma I did try to buy moto, want Toyota Corolla My feelings been they swing like Django Lover Feelings been they swing like Django Lover Now you crash your Ferrari for Lekki Bona Now so much you remake it have been all over My feelings did they swing like Django Lover Feelings did they swing like Tim 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 Bani Keturu Echu I'm a white dog in Fenisu Why you say I did nothing for you And if I do anything you want me to do Timbani Keturu Echu I'm a white dog in Fenisu Why you say I did nothing for you And if I do anything you want me to do Maybe another time, maybe another life You will be my wife and we'll get it right You don't cast, last, last Now everybody go jump break fast Have to say bye bye yo Bye bye yo To the love of my life My eye yo Don't cry yo I need people and shy 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 yo He don't cast, last, last Now everybody go to a breakfast Shadow Shadow Carry on To say bye bye yo, bye bye yo, to the love of my life, my yo, don't cry yo. I need big bo and shadow, 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 yo. Nice, 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 I feel like you're mine. Oh. But I love you, cause I never make you mine. Oh. If 
belly to smoke his you gon' lose my life If you're bad with nothing, I'ma spend the night Baby, we're thinking of love me every day Now my dancing is up on the apple face Say hello, I'm gonna be here And I'm making my new days home I'm gonna lie, I'm gonna be here for you every day When you call, when it's back on your plate For your love, I'm gonna be here For your love, I'm gonna be here this is the final look i'm so 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 in love so obsessed i love how the potty gel came out like it's so perfect it matches my skin perfectly and i can't believe i did duck nails for the first time i did a little moon cut crescent shape with the tips like this set has to be my best so far if you watched all the way thank you so much let me know what you think in the comments guys i'll see you all in my next one bye